Okay guys, this is Zombie Boy, the Gaming Light Boss is bringing you another info log. This one about the upcoming Call of Duty Black Ops 2, which is coming out November, I can't remember the date. So anyway, uh, we're just going to do some little information on it, little background, stuff like that. So we're going to start with the story mode. Now I've got a lot of information I've copy and paste from the website. Some words I won't read because I don't know if I've even copied them right. So here we go. Here's what it says. So largely in the future, the second release in Black Ops sub-franchise will see players transported between the mid-1980s and a mechanically enhanced war zone of 2025. With a large portion of the game to be held in the year 2025, it appears the coming 13 years are to be tough ones in a real world with a plethora of futuristic weaponry and machines to see battles fought out with a selection of drones fitted with chain guns rocket launchers, weaponized quadricopters, and a bevy of similarly scary foes. Despite offering an insight into upcoming technologies, the 2025 setting sees Trek on a fine line between realistic evolution and a uh, word I can't read, sci-fi of futurism. And they're on the right side of the fence with not a single laser shooter, ray gun, or teleportation device in sight, which I think is a good idea. You mean, Call of Duty was always about realism in war, and you know, lasers and ray guns, they should be kept for zombies. Zombies is the one that isn't meant to be based on real life, and that's just meant to be fun and good stuff. But anyway, that information about zombies is coming later in the year, info log. So anyway, and now I've got some information about the characters of Black Ops 2. Yes, we've got some characters in bold. So, first of all, we've got Franks Wood making an appearance, a uh, member of the first Black Ops one, as the narrator throughout the whole thing, I think. We'll be playing as the Mason family, which is also from Black Ops, uh, first Black Ops, I think. You'll be playing the 80s with Alex Mason and in 2025 with his son, David Mason, but his name is David, but I typed it in David, didn't I? I'm a fool. And the main enemy is a man called Raul Menendez, who actually appears in both the 1980s and the 1925. So he is a real pain in the buttocks of the Mason family. So that's what I got for characters, guys, and story. I'll be back for the second part, which is all going to be on zombies, which I can't wait for. We got some quotes, and we got some information, and we got the picture. So I'll uh, be back soon, guys. Okay, I'm back. Now we got some information on zombies, and as you can see, this picture is the picture that was released on a little. I can't, don't know the website. I'm very sorry, but it is trying to give a hint of zombies. As you can see, we got a big two in the background for Black Ops Two. And it seems we've got a mysterious woman holding a shotgun or holding the head of a dead person. Quite graphic pictures, but I think this is definitely a hint towards zombies. So anyway, this is the information I have. Following unprecedented popularity in past releases, Black Ops 2 is set to see a return of zombies with the living dead given free reign of a selection of multiplayer formats. So yes guys, if you didn't know, instead of using a modified single player um, campaign, um, what's it called, technology type thing, they changed it to multiplayer. So this could mean leveling up, it could mean different game types, lots of different maps, you know, you could level up your guns individually so you can choose whether you have red dot sight, extended maps, whatever you want. I don't know, I'm just making speculations on what I've been told, I don't even know if that's the right word. But that is, I am, that is what I'm doing. Yeah. So guys, um, that's it for Zombie Fit. But we have some, um, we have some, what's it, quotes in a minute. Uh, I need to write all the pictures so I can have the quotes up while I'm reading them. So I'll be back in a minute once I've got the pictures all sorted out. See you in a minute. Hey guys, I'm way back. Um, now, this is a quote we have for Zombies made, well, it'll say in the quote, now, I have read these before, but I can't remember what they say, so uh, I'm just going to read it off. So here we go. The fan favorite mode will make a return, only this time it's running in the multiplayer engine. That's what I was looking for, engine. Gaming specialist CVG reported, that means there will be a big upsurge in numbers when it comes to Black Ops 2's undead sub-game. The multiplayer engine can throw around twice as many shambling holes at once, and it can handle a co-op play double as bl double Black Ops 2. I did not read it right, I'm sorry. So that means eight players. From what I'm reading, that means eight players. It means there's more zombies each round on the map, I think. More dead bodies on the ground. Passive atmosphere. Sounds amazing. 
multiplayer engine, that was what I was looking for, engine. So guys, that's the first quote, bring in the second quote in just a minute. Okay guys, don't way back. Now this is the second quote, now you got to give me a break here. I'm actually reading it off the screen because I couldn't be bothered to copy and paste it, so here we go. To maximise this increased Treyarch are promote promising new modes too. They're stopping short of specifics for now, but say you can expect team games of some sort to feature in what sure to be the most hectic take on the mode yet. So which means game modes, like I said, some game modes maybe team deathmatch of eight players. Free for all, that would be a good idea. Free for all, all in for themselves. So anyway, that's the last bit of information I have. Um for Black Ops 2 if you like the video, please give it a like below, and see it. And I hope I'll bring these out every Friday. See you in a minute. I uh, just need to give one bit of info, and then I'll be it for now. So see you in a minute, guys. Okay, last bit, guys. This is the website I got all my information from. Um, if you want the more information and all of the information from this website, the link will be in the description to the Black Ops 2 page. Um, for zombies, what you have to do is scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on. Uh, Black Ops 2 campaign and zombies, or say something like that. So, yeah, that's all we have to do, guys. So, this is Zombie Boy for Gaming Like Bosses signing out in for logs every Friday about new big games coming out or games I will think everyone else will enjoy. So, please, guys, give it a like if you did and um, subscribe. I have more coming soon. So, bye, guys. See you sometime.